guys um welcome to another great video um super excited right now i always record my videos in the evening so it's calm quiet and i can think straight and everything maybe all bets have been settled or all problems let me not bore you with all that now first off i want to tell you something you see this app i'm on right now i'm going to tell you something very special about this app there's something really special about it but i observed that the few people who watch my videos since my channel is new they tend not to finish um watching my video like they don't watch till the end you just watch part way and you go you know this way it's not going to really help me to make more videos that you're going to enjoy at the same time it's not going to help uh you understand what i'm trying to show you so i recommend that you stay on the video till the end and one more thing if you're able to stay on the video till the end i'm going to tell you the name of this app and um how by the time you watch this video to the end you should have known how you can make the maximum use of this app to make your betting business take it to another level so you don't need to go around looking for people to give you tips to play your bets you should be able to raise a whole lot of uh, beautiful odds for yourself that's going to you know <laughs> make life so sweet without further ado ladies and gentlemen let's just get started like i said i'm going to tell you the name of the app and where you're going to get the app from by the end of the video so you want to stick around till the end and if this is the first time you're jumping on my channel you see my videos me i remain your big boy your humble boy i'm love mko i do videos about how to make betting uh betting business push forward how to be good with picking your bets making your tips where to bet on and all and all and all if you're here with me you've come to the right place i don't want to bore you out with too much talk don't forget to subscribe so as we go ahead i'll always remind you to subscribe <laughs> so let's just get started first of all i want you to put something in mind what kind this is um this app helps you for football betting if you are into football betting maybe soccer for those of you in america or the united states if you're into soccer betting or football betting for the rest of the world um i want you to put take note of this very app don't forget that we discussed bet minds before okay there are some things that there's a way you can combine some of this app to work to your advantage so what we're going to do by the towards the end of the video okay since i really want you to stay on the video towards the end of the video i'm going to show you how you combine bet minds app with this very app for you to make your bets or your, your prediction quite quite unique so first of all i want to ask you what market do you bet on do you bet on the over goals or do you bet on the under goals okay let me assume that you bet on uh, teams to win or both teams to score or any market that you like whatever the market is i want to pretend that you already have one in your mind and this is what you really bet on but on this video i'm going to use one market to help you as a point and towards all of the other ones right here using this app so first of all let me just show you something if you come here uh we are right now let's start with the ukrainian league you can see ukraine premier league um so if you come here right now you can see uh we have um uh the first game here i don't know what's the what's the message there i think uh something like abandoned or something i don't know so let's just leave that one out which means that the game was not played but there's another one the shakhtar the next game look closely right here you can see there's a prediction here 63 there's a that's a percentage okay it's saying that 63 percent possibility for this game to go in favor of the home team while there's a 24 percent possibility for the game to end in a draw and then there's a 13 percent possibility for the game to end with the home uh with the away team winning now this percentage here most times i like to use percentage on this very app on this very very app I like to use percentage from 60 up or to make it even bigger I just go from 55 up I'll let you know why this is so from 55 percent is a very good one it's, it's actually a for this very app so if you, if you get home team to win at 55 percent it's a good one okay and if you get um like okay like we see here 53 percent for 
uh, the first game I'm talk I was just talking about. See that it shows you see the 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 shade of red is darker than the other ones. It shows you that yes, we're very sure about this. Like let me show you another example. If you come over here, you can see the shade of red right here. But this one is not as dark as the shade of red here. Or rather, let me not use that. It's not as dark as let me let me kill that one out. Let me show you with this. You see the shade of red here, and you see the shade of red right here you see that that the shade of red for 69 is way darker than the one we have for 44 it's only telling you that well this is much more uh, assured than the other the darker one is more assured than the lighter one now this is really not what i want to show you so what i want to show you is this when you come over here for example the shakta the next and the uh, po tava okay now click on it just click on the game click right on the game scroll up a bit i want to show you something you can look over here if you're the type who wants um to play the goals let me start from the goals if you this is one of the most most played option in football betting okay so let me start from the goals if you like to play goals more i want you to look at this okay right here this 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 right here average scored goals and look at the this ones we're going to be working with this ones right here so we have the average concede goals we have the average scored goals for both teams okay the first one updates for the home team and then the one bottom is for the away team now look average scored goals too which means on the average it's not saying that every game it must score goals sometimes it scores three um rather it's not saying every game it must score two goals it's only saying that sometimes it gets to three goals sometimes it gets to four goals sometimes it scores one sometimes it scores zero but the point is if you calculate everything it falls down to two goals on the average you understand while the away team has 1.3 goals scored on the average so we can assume or we can believe that um, the home team shatter the next scores more often than the away team is that is that being is as that fact being established let's just establish that fact first of all before we go ahead then um the next thing is the, the goals considered we can see that on the average shakta donors concede 1.4 goals a game while the away team um paul tava concedes 1.2 goals a game which shows that shakta donors concedes more than the game the, the team is playing against on the average um now if we want to now take put in mind put in mind um this information is based on the last 10 games not for the entire season okay so you may go back to the entire season and see that okay the the actually shakta the net does not concede more than them you know stuff like that but what it does is it takes record of the last 10 games to know the form that this current team is on you know i personally think that the way you played in the last five games actually is your form now if you stretch it to 10 it actually gives you a bigger room to decide very well it gives it gives uh the the the, the accuracy there is, is even better than the five but to help you quickly you can work with five but this app works with 10 which makes it awesome and it helps you do all that now if you want to play uh, a game like this you, it's simple to, to to see that okay this team scored two goals and then the opposition scores 1.3 what i do i'll take what um the team a scores i'll take what team b scores and i'll add it together okay so two plus 1.3 is going to give us 3.3 .3 goals so the combination of both the home and the away team produces 3.3 .3 goals per match on the average okay okay let's yes per match because these two are bringing in their statistics into the game so we are expecting that okay these people are going to score 1.3 goals today that's your position and we're expecting that okay the home team is going to score um two goals today you understand so this is the expectation we are having coming to the game so we add it together that's when we get at 3.3 .3 goals in just this very game and how many goals are we expecting that these two teams are going to consider so we are going to add together 1.4 and 1.2 so we are going to add 1.4 plus 1.2 giving us 2.6 
2.6 goals is what we are expecting here so if you if you if you dip it very very well you discover that at least no matter what there's going to be a goal scored in this game do you understand a goal will come out of this game now i don't want you to i don't want to push you in the direction where you, i want you to think how many goals are going to be scored in the game and um is it going to give us 1.5 2.5 3.5 or under 3.5 or um 2.5 or whatever it is no what i want you to do is i want you to take note of games that will produce goals for you that's why i want first of all for you to establish in your mind the second thing i want you to establish is the possibility for the which team is going to be on top at the end of the day and this is going to help you in live in play for example you can see right here that um the home team has two losses in the last 10 games has five wins in the last 10 games and has three draws in the last 10 games you can see the away team has four wins in the last 10 games has four losses in the last 10 games and has two draws in the last 10 games you can see the wins are with the green the red are with uh with uh, for the losses while the white is for the gray is for the draws that they've had now what this means is this if that's the last 10 games though if i'm thinking very well and say okay yeah they've lost to 20 percent of their games the last 10 20 percent two games hmm the next now you'll simply do is come over here look at the odds they gave the home team to win 1.3 look at the odds they gave the away team to win 7.0 now take note 63 percent uh, possibility for the home team to win still ringing in our mind isn't it now uh just 13 percent for their way to win well well i think um based on some few facts i can say this is getting somewhere okay it's getting somewhere but let me help you decide first of all let me help you really decide first of all who scores more the home team right who concedes more the same home team my friend, if I was going to play this game, I would turn my face away from who is going to win and who is going to lose. I'm going to simply go for the goals. Do you understand? Okay, now look. Um, just take a look at this. Look at the result. Three goals to two. Now, if you can, if I was to advise from the beginning, I would have told you, just go ahead and play both teams are going to score, which is goal, goal. It's just simple because simple it's con it concedes goals more than the the away team which is supposedly supposed to be the weakest team in this case so simple and the away team at least scores more than one goal a game it's giving us a clue a goal is going to come from the away team i wish you expect one from the home team now let's go scroll at random and do another game yes just scroll at random and stop uh i really don't like where we stop though but um what do we do okay this is not a very popular league so i'm not going to use analysis on this i'm talking about this tanzania premier league it's not a very very popular league so i'm going to go to a much more popular league that at the end of the day is going to you're going to find in your book uh book uh, makers or bookies or whatever <laughs> whatever they are called so let's just tap on this oh uh, bear in mind whatever the score line is uh usually i don't know if it's if it's updated on this last 10 games but i really don't think so i really don't think so i don't believe so because this was there before the game even played you know so it's really not updated on on this list here so let's quickly do the same analysis if you look closely okay we're here let's just quickly use this first of all first of all take a look we have 42 42 percent for the home team to win we have 25 percent for the away team to win and then 33 percent for a draw to happen so this is the reason why the bet was played as a win or draw one x as you already know now average goal scored by the home team 1.1 this is not a very huge scoring team from the average goals already know that then the average goal scored by the away team is 1.12 
interest in these two teams score the same amount of goals in the last 10 games now what about the ones they considered the average goals considered by the home team is 0 0.8 don't let in too many goals while the average goals considered by the away team is 0 0.6 wow oh wow 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 if i was going to play this it would have been very very interesting what would i have played honestly without thinking about seeing the score line already i would have been looking towards before i go there, about that i already i told you what we're supposed to do is put together the the goal scored by both the home team and the away team so we have goal scored here and goal scored here so a total of 1.1 plus 1.1 giving us 2.2 and then um, the goals considered both of them giving us 1.2 mm, so 2.2 and 1.2 which means that we're looking at at least a goal in this game at least a goal and the worst case scenario is 1.5 <sighs> am i saying this because i've seen the score line well i guess i'm being biased right now but I believe at least a goal is going to come in this game yeah at least 0 0.5 now this is being playing safe if you really want to play it go out all out and play it very well you come over here take a look at this you can see the odds for 1.5 would have been would have been um 1.41 so i think 1.5 would have been safe if you really want to go ahead and um play uh get good odds 1.5 1.5 over 1.5 basically would have been safe now let's stop here and then compare or take bring in our other app called um bet mines let's see what bet mines thinks about this game now what's the league colombia premier a clause so let's come over here to bet mines click on bet mines okay let's let it load up then look for Columbia Primera, I don't know. That was it, right? Okay. Okay. Independent, it was it? Was it again? Let me just double check that. I wasn't sure. Okay. Independent area, the Rio Negro. Those are the two teams playing. I think it's right here. So, Independent and Rio, Rio Negro Aquila. So, okay. Yes. Uh, we can see Batman says this game is supposed to go under 3.5. Look at it right here. So minus if you follow the, the Batman video, it's right here on this channel. You'll see where I, where we discussed all this um Batman you know stuff. So it's under 3.5 and then it is 84% um assurance for the game to go under 3.5. Okay, so and then it's a green for Batman. You can see um I think this this alone shows you oh uh, the power of what you can do on your own and what top. Uh, or, or automation can also help you get i don't know if bet mines does it the way we do but um i think it's close it's close so what is the other um my bad what's the other app called it's called soccer predictions okay just go on play store if you're on um if you're on um android i don't really know if it's on ios honestly i have no idea but i'm going to show you the app and what it looks like okay so let me just go soccer predictions right here okay this is what it looks like right here so let me just show that to you okay so when you want to get the app that's what it looks like okay so yes at this point at this point I'll say if you really liked what you what you learned this evening and you followed along to this point, I'm sure I'm sure you really liked what you saw and what you learned. Yes, I'm going to be recording most of my uh, videos on phone on mobile because most of us use the phone, and most of these app are all only restricted to the mobile phone. The PC versions, uh, there's no website for some of them, so. It's, it really makes it easy for me and at the same time for you to be able to assess them okay so if you really really like what i uh, what i do or what you learned from my channel please give me a subscribe share my video to your friends as well 
okay it will help my channel grow so i can make even more research more beautiful ideas more more predictions more content more awesome work for you and then you become a better better down the lane down down the line don't mind me i'm not really that much of a uh, speaker mm -hmm. we'll put it that way so thank you very much for watching please like and subscribe click the bell notification so you see my next video immediately i drop it because i'm dropping one immediately after this one okay um see you on the next one peace